guys welcome back to my channel i'm going for grocery shopping i just finished taking my bath i did my skincare i'm going to the market i'm just wearing casual because i know i'm taking bike to the market it's not so far the road is so bad i've gone to the supermarket i've done grocery shopping bought some stuff household stuff and some provisions and, and um, drinks and snacks i've been able to get some food stuff i've gotten like the basics so i still have some other stuff that i couldn't get because when i went there the first time i had to go with bike i'm going to get just a few stuffs that are remaining i didn't buy the heavy stuffs like yam potatoes irish potato um plantain and then i have this bedside lamp that i got um the bulb that i have for it is not matching it so i'm going to get another bulb i need to get um to tissue holder um and then fruits those are just like the basics that i'm getting so um this was the list of the things that i wanted but i already got more than half of this so this is the remaining list so there are not much of it so those are the things that i'm getting for now so the furniture guy is supposed to come today like that furniture guy is pissing me off it's taking time that's why my tv is on the floor i have to call the dstv person to come fix it just just come and fix it like that let it be on the floor because my subscription has expired three weeks like it's expired and i recharged it again without it playing almost one month so has expired on me i just told the dstv guy come and fix it let me be watching it on the floor like that until the furniture person comes because <laughs> I can't keep waiting because I'm supposed to put TV console here behind me. I have an order that came from Shein. They called me yesterday. They will bring it, but rain started falling. So the dispatch rider couldn't bring it. So I think the person is definitely bringing it to them. I have another order coming from DHL. All those things, I'm expecting them today. I need to say this. The last video that I did, the last video that I uploaded after creating that content, I, I broke down. I was so sick. I had to, I went to the hospital like I was hospitalized. I was taking injection like it was not funny like one week sickness i still have the cough i'm still trying to like it that's the only remaining thing that is remaining to go you know cough doesn't really go like that easily especially if it's a serious one so but thank god i am strong now i i am okay now so back to work so let me check you guys to grocery shopping <music> good morning it's another day today is thursday so yesterday was really hectic for me ah god like i couldn't even film the entire market because at a point it started raining and it was really really heavy so we had to hide inside an abattoir to wait for the rain to subside i looked around while waiting i saw good head two good heads so my friend was like hmm, i want to buy good head i think i want to make pepper soup with it so i was like okay since i already got fresh fish i want to use and make pepper soup one of these days i'm like what am i doing with good head maybe i should just do like unkwabi like good head like ECU. that's what we call it the way we make unkwabi that's how we can make it today i'm going to make good head and i want to make small sauce i'm going back to the market because yesterday i went with bike in fact i came back with keke i i chatted keke i was like oh i would have just gotten the yam like so because i got a lot um especially fruits um i'm so glad that yesterday i was able to get um my package from shane from shine abi shane i don't know so i'm going to be unboxing it in this video but i don't think it's today i have a lot to do today so i'm going to the market not exactly right now I want to do that early enough the furniture guy is supposed to come yesterday because of the heavy downpour the, the rain was really heavy i felt it as well 
so they said okay he's going to come today around one i don't know if he's even coming at all i've given up on that guy so if he comes we'll film it but i'm not canceling any of my plans because he said he's coming the chicken is old layers it's always strong i love it for my sauce so i'm going to like parboil it now and then head to the market i need to get yam i couldn't buy yam yesterday there's no light i don't know pardon me if the generator is making sound i have to put on the gen to charge up my phone i'm going to parboil the chicken because it takes time to get done but while i'm getting ready for the market if the, the chicken is boiling so before i leave i'm going to put it down i'm going to market to get the ecu stuff to have a long day today so i need to make myself like very light breakfast and then go so let me find something and make
Good morning. Yesterday was really, really hectic. I had to sleep in a friend's place. I couldn't sleep here. I just go back to the house. This place is really messy, messed up. Let me show you guys around. And I have a lot of things to do today. When I went for buying the interior decor, I've not tried it since because the furniture person hasn't brought my stuff since. And then yesterday I tried to power test the because I was I was able to get bulb for the bedside lamp. So I tried testing it and I found out that one is not working. So I chatted them all up via Instagram yesterday and they told me to bring it back today. The furniture people are not even done with fixing my stuff. They came really late yesterday so they are coming back this evening to continue so i don't still think i'll still do clean up in this house today this is what i'm talking about so i had to move everything from that was there to the bed on top of the bed so that they will see space to fix everything that they are fixing i couldn't start bringing them down sleeping on it and everything so i just decided to go to a friend's place there are still a lot of stuff to be fixed and then you can see how this place is it's just scattered, messed up. Look at so, see now. So it's not so. I wanted to sleep on the floor there, but this is the TV console that they were fixing yesterday, and I tried putting in some stuff, and it's making sense to me. I even washed my clothes are still in the washing machine. I have not been able to spread it. I abandoned it there. I'm going to spread it now. Yes, this is the lamp that I'm talking about. The bedside lamp so i tried it yesterday and i figured out that one isn't working so i'm going to return the one that is not working this is left for me to do today i had an appointment i have i had plans of fixing my nails today i don't know how that will work but where i'm going to we say market to change this thing if i'm able to finish on time maybe i'll just sit down there by the market site and just fix the nail because i have this sip and paint i'm supposed to go for it tomorrow and I just want to, don't want to go there. Like, that's the plan that I have for tomorrow. For it to be easier for me to be able to fix this nail today is just the only option I have. Returning this in the same market area, I'll just fix the nail and then come back. Because if I finish this in and then come back, and it's another area that I'm going to like fix the nail and everything. Oh, God. It's going to really be hectic and stressful. I'm ready to step out now. I'm going to say market. I want to return the lamp that is bad. So from there, hmm, there's no time. This is, uh, I think, around past three. So if I still have time, I'm going to just do the nails there. So this is my outfit. The top is from Sheen or Shine. I don't know. This trouser is from my local vendor. And she styled it. She designed it by herself. Vicky Closets. And this flip-flop is a gift from my other sister so the hair is from just memes so guys let's go today is saturday i wasn't able to fix my nail yesterday so i came here tangles to fix my nails today this is morning i need to do this before i go for the sip and paint in the afternoon back from the salon where i went to make my nails and this is the nails that i finally did i love the fact that it's short and i love the color square shape i haven't heard from the furniture guy i'm already dressed for sip and paint i have made reservations since um i think on tuesday i'm supposed to be going with my friend i'm dressed up and i'm ready but he said he went to the hospital to check up on his friend so this um painting stuff is supposed to be from one to six and guys this is like almost 4 p.m and i am still in the house and this is the outfit i'm putting on the top and the trouser 
is from Shane. Shane or Shine. You guys know what I'm talking about. Okay, I don't know how to pronounce it. That's not an English word. And if you have not seen the Troy and Hall, you can go check it out. I love this. This is the first time I'm stepping out with this two combo. And I love this trouser. So the shoe, I'm just going to just sip and paint now. So it doesn't need to be so serious, you know. And then um, I just started this skincare journey that I'm doing. So I need my face to breathe. The flip-flop is from my junior sister. She gave me as a birthday gift this year during my birthday. Calvin and Kate. This bag fashion and bag 1987 i got this from thrift i got this from oka thrift i painted my toenails white i painted it white let me say let's go hopefully we are going for this sip and paint <music> so i'm here at um National Children's Park and Zoo. They close around six. So missed the painting, sip and paint appointment. Go ahead, it's 15 minutes to six. The person was like, we can't do that again. Cause of course we cannot use 10 minutes and do sip and paint now. So I'm chatting them up on Instagram. I want to know if they can reschedule to another day, maybe tomorrow or next week definitely looking for a place like somewhere to eat dinner so that's the event for now there was serious hold up on the road so that delayed me as well i couldn't get here it's my fault i didn't leave on time but trying to know if i can do this thing within one hour but there was serious hold up like i think a lot of cars had an accident about three to four or five or more than so the the road was closed down and they are trying to tow the cars away from the road so there was a mad hold up and that caused delay as well that's why i'm getting here very late so let me just find somewhere to do dinner and yeah I was able to reschedule. I rescheduled it till this weekend. So on Saturday, I'm going back. So I'm going to be putting that on the next vlog because this vlog is ending here. There has been a lot of activities and some I couldn't even document. The furniture guy came back um yesterday to finish up the furnishing. Um he brought the everything like I I wouldn't say furnishing, the remaining furnitures and fixing, but he wasn't able to fix every damn thing that I wanted him to fix for me because I have some wall picture frames and everything that I wanted him to fix, but he didn't come with enough nail. So bad. So I have an electrician that um, helps me do do small, small jobs. So I've called him today, but I don't think he's coming to because he went for work. So he told me he might come this evening or tomorrow. So tomorrow I'm going to fix up every remaining damn thing, like all those little details. So after that, I'm going to do a proper house tour. After fixing up everything, I wasn't able to do the unboxing. Like the two cartons are just staring at me. I'm sure going to be including it in the next vlog. Because this list is just scattered. You guys are going to see like everything in my upcoming videos. I would have done like clean with me. So you guys will see like, oh, damn. I am not even in the mood to film. So I just started to just face, play music while I do the clean up. And it's not just clean up. After clean up, arranging the entire house. Yeah, that's all that it is. I hope you enjoyed this vlog. Uh, please subscribe if you've not yet subscribed. I'm going to see you next time in my next video. Bye.